live from Studio 46, this is CBS 2 News This Morning. Flames shooting through the windows of fire tears through a Queens home overnight, sending eight people to the hospital, four of them with life-threatening injuries. Plus, some relief from the hot weather. Eight New York City pools open today, but there are new rules to protect swimmers from COVID-19. And it is opening day for the Mets at City Field. The Empire State Building lit up in blue and orange for the big day. Good morning on this Friday, July 24th. I'm Chris Wright. And I'm Mary Calvi. Welcome to CBS 2 News this morning. We'll have the day's top stories in just a moment, but first, let's get a check on your forecast for this Friday and then maybe a peek into the weekend. Here's John. Well, let's take a big peek into the weekend because the big heat is back this weekend. You know, we broke the five day heat wave yesterday. We're going to see a repeat day today in the mid 80s. But yeah, it's right back with those big numbers later Saturday into Sunday. Real quickly, a big thank you to the acting president of the CBS2 Mets fan club, Joey Simeone, who gifted me these fabulous socks back on Christmas. I can finally wear them today. Just a stray shower possible for the Mets play ball. Back to you guys. Boss knows he's been demoted to second in charge. All right, John, thank you so much. Well, thank you for watching. I'm Chris Raggy. And I'm Mary Calvi. Your local news continues on our streaming service, CBSN New York. CTM is next. Have a great day. Thank <laughs> you.